When I first got here, I was confused about where I was and why I was here. The family I worked for before said they owned me. They told me to lie about my age and my name, so I always did. But the teachers at the center helped. One of the first things they taught Priya was that no one can be owned. They taught her that each person has unique qualities and traits and that she should be proud of who she is. It wasn't long before she would happily say, I am Priya. I am a 14-year-old child. I am no one's property. I am free to be a child. The caregivers here asked me what I wanted to be when I grew up. I had a choice. Now I know that if I work hard at school, I can be a doctor or a teacher or anything else that I dream to be. They told me that all children deserve love and to be treated the same, no matter what caste or religion. And they even celebrated my birthday with singing, dancing, throwing petals. It was so wonderful. The center also wanted to help Priya learn to take care of herself. The first thing Priya learned was to trim her nails, to wash and brush her teeth every day. I wasn't sure how to do this at first, but the caregivers told me that it's fine to ask questions. Now I'm an expert. And then she had a haircut. It was the first time in years. Then Priya chose some fresh clothes and shoes. The caregivers also told her about the normal changes that happen in people's bodies as they grow up. So she didn't feel embarrassed when they started. Another new experience was having a routine. Regular meals meant that Priya never worried about when she would next eat. And that was only the beginning. From morning exercise to classroom lessons and from art to music to meditation, the days are always busy. It was hard at first, but I soon got into the swing of things. At the end of this, with clean clothes, clean teeth, tidy hair and a busy daily routine, Priya felt like a new person. I was happier with respect for myself, independence and new skills, ones that will help me for the rest of my life. The better Priya felt about herself, the more she wanted to be with other people. She started to look forward to her future and make plans for life when she left the center. Like Priya, you are an individual and deserve to be respected. Everyone does. Show kindness to those around you. Look after and take care of yourself. Know that you are no one's property. You are not owned. No humans are. You can learn to laugh out loud, play games and have fun with your friends and be curious about the world around you. You should enjoy your childhood. Remember that there are people who care about you and your well-being.